Hi Windsource viewers, we're at Hardware Pioneers Max 2024. I'm here with Lene, um, who's going to tell us a bit more about Windsource. So Lene, um, thank you for joining us. And um, uh, first of all, can you introduce what you do at Windsource and then what Windsource does um, in general? Hi. I'm Lene, I'm from Windsource. I'm the sales management from the Windsource Electronic Companies and established in 1999. Windsource is a global, uh, it's a lead, leading global electronic distributor uh, with over 24 years experience uh, based in China. Our core advantage is to uh, supply the comprehensive supply chain to our customers and help them optimize their purchasing process and save their cost. Um, so obviously um, the semiconductor shortage was, was a big issue, it still is a bit of an issue. Um, as a, a component sourcing company, um, do, you, do, do you think it's as bad as it was or has it improved at all? What kind of is the, what's kind of the status of the semiconductor shortage at the moment? Yeah, the <laughs> semiconductor uh, has been a, call, a challenge since the COVID-19. Uh, all of these situations have recovered a little now. The demand is still far exceeds the supply, especially in the automotive and the smart device factors. I think this situation uh, is likely to continue for a while. So, um, in terms of the strategies that Windsource uses to make sure engineers can always get the components that they need, um, what do you guys do? Firstly is the global sourcing networking. We have over 3,000 suppliers all over the world. We can give uh, more channels and solutions to our to the engineers to solve their problems. And secondly is that we have a very strict quality guarantee. Uh, we have many certificates about this and to ensure our products is real and reliable. And the firstly is the flexible purchasing choice. Since uh, we have over 3,000 suppliers all over the world, we have many stock and many suppliers. The engineers can buy in Europe, America, or in China. It depends on their choice. It's very flexible. Yeah. Cool. And um, I know you guys really pride yourselves on um, your service to your engineers. So, um, what what are some of those? Um, what are some of the ways you make sure to communicate what this current state is of components is and make sure they're always kept up to date? Yeah, I think firstly is the regular update through our website and the email. Uh, we will send the order status and the deliver information to our customers, let them know their orders. And, uh, and we will send the regular news to them. And, f and secondly is the uh, is the personalized uh, customer service. Every customer will have their inclusive sales to support their, support their needs and, and help them solve their problems. And, first, and thirdly is the uh, professional technical department. When our customers have something, some problems with their products and uh, after sales, we will give them help and solve the problems. Cool. Yeah. And um, I guess you guys really have your finger on the pulse of what's actually got shortages and what's pretty safe these days. What, um, what products would you say people still need to be very aware of there are shortages and which ones would you say are quite safe at the moment? Yeah, the semiconductors, factors and the connectors such as the resistors, capacitors and inductors are easy to obtain with a short lead time. However, like the, like the high-end process and the application specific integrated circuits as well as the height of the end of life products and the, and the obsolete products is still very hard to obtain. But finding them is where wind source excels. Are you with my engineers, sir? Eh?